What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, John for the Game Dude here, welcoming you to episode 120 of Saga Log. Now, I have a special guest with me for episode 120. Somebody who you all knew was going to be on Saga Log at some point. Y'all knew it. We have Jonas. Jonas is here. Meep. Meep, boop. Beep, boop, boop. Um, and part of the reason why Jonas is here is, well, we, we had something that went out recently. We did. And there's a reason why I'm wearing this hat. If you guys don't know why I'm wearing this hat, I have a link in the description below. You should Ooh, definitely check wow. out and then come back. Because, yeah. <laughs> Context. I'm wearing this hat because he's wearing a hat. Yep. It has no relevance to anything. <laughs> no relevance to anything. So, we're going to the Elite Four, and I'm definitely scared and worried about literally everything, because why am I not? And, yeah, I'm going to do a team recap. So. Oh, and you have different controls. <laughs> yeah, I do. So, we have our 2-7, Brittany in the front, lowest level currently, uh, level 68 with a mild nature. Own tempo as an ability with Heat Wave, Aqua Jet, Fly, and Surf. Context, John lost our melodic we had to Roxanne. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Yep. That's so sad. So, not looking good for you, Brittany. Sorry, Brittany. You're probably going to die now. We have our manager, Ernesto, still su surprisingly alive with uh, level 69 expert belt holding with the lax nature, runaway as an ability, tail glow, air slash, bug buzz, and U turn. So that way I can get out of situations and still do chip. Funny number. Yeah, all of them are trained up to level 69, because that's actually the mid-range of Flint. <laughs> then we have Dakon holding the black sludge, sassy nature. You can tell it's a male because he's got the bigger ball sack on his neck. Wait, really? Yeah. You know these gender differences. Like, did you know that I'm wearing a male Magikarp on my head? If um. you didn't know, why? What do you figure out what the determining factor is? <laughs> then we got low kick, bulk up, poison fang, and toxic. <laughs> <laughs> then we have Tito, speaking of uncles and peoples, we have Tito with the hardy nature, with effect spore as an ability. Honestly, I don't like Tito's stats. Mm -hmm. All around, it's like, eh. Then we got Seed Bomb, Earthquake, Surf, and Air Slush. That's like one of the best movesets I've seen in a Pokemon. Yeah, I love its moveset. It's just, it's stats. It's level 70, particularly, because it's better than the manager. <laughs> Tito looking to overthrow the manager. Then we have Lucario holding a mind plate with a jolly nature, with Volt Absorb as an ability, so it does have some utility, and it's got Shadow Ball or Shadow Claw strength, Psychic type judgment, and extreme speed. And then we have Babe, which I literally forgot about already, unfortunately. Sorry, Babe. With the careful nature, no guard, rock smash, rock climb, waterfall, and magma storm. <laughs> Babe's moves. Babe became the HM Pokemon, um, which is kind of really sad because Babe does not deserve this life, but she got it. Well, that's okay though. It's just a it's just a fire horse. It's just your typical fire horse. That's the wrong person. It's just the one of the only two fire types you get in this generation. We actually uh, Mega had the other one. Mega had an Infernape on his team. Nice. So I am going to go heal because healing is always a good thing. But I'm scared. So, yeah, we can talk about the thing. Oh, yeah, we can talk about the thing. I I, I, wow. I can actually say the word gear log without having to bleep it. Wow. It's kind of weird. It's kind of surreal. It feels weird <laughs> to finally have the videos going to be going out. Yeah, because when this, so basically, so for actually even more added context, we're in three hours, your luck's going to be out to the public. Wow. Um, so it's kind of, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, is, are we actually doing this? This is actually happening? And currently in the game, we're almost where we are right now in this game. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we are probably about a week and a half to two weeks away from this point in year lock two. Yeah. So it's... Which we would have been there already, but we... We've, we've experienced some difficulties. Yeah, we were taking a break from the uh, for the holiday 
That is, yeah. A good, that. good old holiday, fashions holiday. Yeah, we had to do the teasers. And yeah. I honestly, is it bad that I'm like, the teasers, and I'm like, what teasers I've have gone in? I've went through this so many times. I trained, like, two Palkias to level 100, only going to the Elite Four over and over again for no reason. Two Palkias to level yeah. 100? Why? I don't know, man. <laughs> I also trained an Electivire to level 100, and I trained a Bidoof that I caught in a Master Ball to level 41. <laughs> but I was like still training it, and I never finished training it. I could go grab the cartridge and <laughs> go through it again. That would be amazing. So, so you all know, as you know, it's 15% level boosted, so Brittany is... Uh, yeah, Brittany's gonna be potentially dead. Britney's getting pounded already. Honestly. I mean, it makes sense. Wow. Um, <laughs> but of yeah, course. so the, the mid-range is level seven or 69, and then the ace of Cynthia is 76. Yeah. I, I, I'm nervous. That's like the normal, that's the normal levels, like when you get uh, the boosted game. Like once you beat the elite for like 15 times or something, they level boost. Yeah, I actually never got to where they level boosted. Oh, um, I've like, gone through a lot because I trained a Palkia. <laughs> Two Palkias and Electivire, Gliscor, and something else. I forgot what, I, to level 100 through it. I might have and just don't remember it because I had level 70 Gyarados. Um, I liked destroying the Elite uh, Four over and over again. I was like show my superiority of my Pokemon training skills. Uh, I don't like that call, though. I'm doing it, but I don't like the call. I I'm already having to switch out of Brittany. <laughs> this is not... <laughs> well, it's because why you're leading with a tank Pokemon. And he led with a tank Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, <too>. exactly. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> like, we <laughs> did not start this Elite Four the way I wanted. <laughs> nah. I was hoping to just be like, yep, we're gonna bop through this, it's, it, it's okay. I didn't want an hour of power, but it, it, it might be what we get. <laughs> I mean, with the, the uh, how fast the HP goes down, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was a critical hit. Nice. The car is good at getting those. I, I like Why was you extreme speed, though? I was not... It's the same base power as strength is. Oh. Well, oof. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to guarantee being faster even though I was already guaranteed faster. <laughs> Gotta just guarantee being faster when you know you already are. Yeah, sure. The thing is, yeah, is it for it with extreme speed though, for it's a fast Pokemon in general. Um, is it though? It's got like a quarter of its base stat in speed. <laughs> yeah, which is still not very high. <laughs> no, I mean, even at a quarter, that'd be 102. Yeah, it'd be 102.5. Yeah, so it's got probably like 90 or 100 base speed, which is. Look at how little experience I gained off of that. Venusaur. Uh, Venusaur is something that I think Ernesto takes out. I hope. Uh, I mean, okay. I was gonna go into Babe, but... Yeah, like, that's what I would have gone into. Also, it's a Venusaur, and I'm kind of hoping it has a Grass-type move that it's gonna hit me with. I could just look at you. It looks like it's looking at you. It's a male, you can tell it because it doesn't have an egg in the the middle of the flower. What? The Venus male or female Venusaurs have an egg right in the middle of the flower. I don't know any of the gender differences. At yeah, all. I just looked. I just noticed him because and studied him recently because I've been going through all the Pokemon sprites from Gen Four. Oh, from Four specifically. Uh, well, yeah, from the generation of one through four because I've been looking at um, and having to get the Pokemon for Johto one hundred percent. Um, 
He's level 66. Yeah. Did I miscalc? Oh no. I did not think you were gonna be level 66. Well, 15%, that's at plus five. And plus two and a half. Okay, never mind. No, it is supposed to be. I did. I did calc right. I just been freaking out because it's really high leveled. <laughs> the HP goes down so slow. It does. If you wonder why I hit the speed up button a lot in the no. this now, like. Oh, it's very oof. Pinter, nice. Wow, he does not have anything to stop Ernesto right now. That's three straight Pokemon just weak to flying. But he has a bug type. And this is what he normally has, his bug type. True! He normally has bug type Pokemon, except for his uh, uh, Drapion, which is actually a poison in dark type. So. Because it starts out as a bug. Yep. But yeah, him not sending up. Dunsparce is the biggest threat for uh, Ernesto. That's hilarious. I still. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna play it safe. I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna go to Dakwon. Although, how heavy is er, Ernesto, not Ernesto, uh, Dunsparce? Isn't, isn't it, like, kind of a lightweight Pokemon? I would think it would probably be around, like, 60 to 70 pounds. Like, I don't think this one-shots. I don't think he's a fat butt. Fuck. Oh no! Oh no! We can't oh, no. escape! We can't... Also, did he not heal once? Um, no. Well, no, I don't know. No. I don't think he did. He used Roost a couple times, but I don't but think he, he didn't... actually used potions. Yeah, he didn't floor store. Nice dude. We got one done. And you, didn't... you defeat Gent Jessica. Gent Jessica. Gent. Gen the gents of the Jessicas. Gen Jensica. <laughs> the Jensica! <laughs> uh, no, but are you, how are you, like, feeling, though, with the, like, your locks, like, going out? Well, um, I'm not really, like, focused on it going out. I don't really care. Like I talked about in the video that I made. Right. about it. It's not really focused on caring about whether or not people view it or about whether or not it is actually doing well. It's more about like us actually producing it and <laughs> making it. Yeah. yeah. No, and that's it kind of it's funny cuz I I I can't wait for it to go out for audience reaction. But if there's no audience to react to it, would I care? No. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't really think that there is too much of an audience to react to it. <laughs> Which is funny, because like, I want to see like what kind of people think about it. I want people to be like, oh my gosh, wow, you're doing this, it's crazy, wow, I'm so excited, I'm gonna watch every episode. Definitely there's not no, gonna happen. No one um, does literally that. Literally nobody, is, it's, it, it, I mean, especially with the fact that, well, we've talked about it, there's a lot that's gone into it over the last five months. Yeah, it, it, yeah, it's definitely been a process. But it's been an exciting process and fun for us to do, which is what matters. Yep. Right? It's just that we are the ones having fun with it, and as long as we're having fun with it, I think it's a positive project overall. Oh, I did that because... Yep, smart. Smart, John. Be smart. Well, I mean, technically, it was smart. Or, no, it didn't do enough damage to be considered smart. Dang it. I was, if I chipped him enough to where it was, like, the heat wave would kill, then that was actually, like, Then it was dumb to even use it in the first place if it didn't do enough to chip to kill. Yeah. Because <laughs> it wouldn't have killed it even if you used it when he didn't heal. It wouldn't yeah. have mattered. Oh, <laughs> one HP. But that was a high roll. Oh, gosh. Bertha... Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's, I do have. Oh, you're gonna heal. Okay. <laughs> He's gonna do it again. Make a the same mistake. So, um, yeah, I uh, let's see. I was going to bring up something that I just had a brain thought of, and I forgot what it was already. Fail. Didn't heal. <laughs> 
<laughs> predicted the the switch. Yeah, she's like, you're switching. I'm gonna hit you yeah. and do three damage, <laughs> and it's entire. Nice. But you know, Dakon's getting some, you know, love a little bit here. Who have we not sent in yet? Babe. Uh, babe. Yep. Is that the only one that hasn't been sent in? I think everybody else has been sent in. No, no Tito. Yeah, you yeah, haven't sent in Luke, the the not Lucario. Wow. Ludicola. I wish. Um, oh, you do well, have a Lucario. <laughs> I do have a Lucario. Yeah. Uh -huh. It's just not a Lucario. Masquerade. Wow, this is uh. This is kind of sad. This is exciting. This is riveting gameplay. <laughs> <laughs> um, I was kind of hoping that I mean at least the first two it sucks because the HP does scroll so yeah. slow like the, the HP scrolling the way that it does in year lock um, makes this game a lot better so what was your plan for doing year lock stuff you're doing a death montage of it yeah I'm making a death montage it makes it a lot harder because we don't have uh, we don't have anything that indicates whether or not something's died Yep, I get to watch it. Yeah, you actually oh. have to sit there and watch the entire thing. It sounds like a pain in the butt. Because it's twice the amount of time. <laughs> That's the time that it took to record the damn thing in the first place. Yep. Again. Although, I can watch them at like point one or 175 and be okay. Yeah. But you also have to make them. The, yeah. the clips and the, put it all together, so even then... Yeah, and download the episodes, and then find the timestamp within the episode. Yeah, yeah, which yeah, that pain in the butt. <laughs> it will be, but it will be worth it because I want to do one for every generation. Mm -hmm. So it's like generation one or <laughs> gen gen one, gen one, <laughs> gen three, <laughs> gen two. Like completely out of gen, order. Gen one, gen one, gen one, <laughs> gen two, gen. <laughs> yeah. Gen 3. Gen 1.5. Gen 3. <laughs> oh. Um, a crit would kill. Nice. It's paralyzed, though. It is? So it's dead. Yep. I was gonna heal. Golduck, not bad. No. Golduck, definitely not bad. What is um, a poke? So we talked about, so off screen. While we were cleaning, we talked about types that were bad, like rock and ice, and uh, what else? What do we say? Rock and ice and grass and ice. So, what types do you think are really good types? Electric. Electric is great. <laughs> just, <laughs> just, just, just electric. electric. With levitate. Oh wait, there's a Pokemon like that actually. There is. Electros has yeah. no weaknesses. Electric. Just straight up. It's like, oh, I got no weaknesses. It's, it's good. Fairy is good. I, I was going to say, the type combination that I would say is Steel and Fairy um, is really good. Is that Mag Magirna? Or what, is yeah. that what that thing's typing is? Magirna, yeah. yeah. Because it's weak to ground. Well. And that's it, I think. It's ground and fire. Yeah. Oh, I didn't even see Because it's immune to poison. Because of its Steel type. Brittany. Yeah, that's you're, pretty good. You're my feel safe. Steel is really good <laughs> in general. Electric steel is great. It, it's in, kind of okay. It's great unless you have. I don't like it. Another type weaknesses. He looks like he's about to call me on me. Ah! This should be Guardian Ace's mascot. What? Because he's fat? I'm just kidding. <laughs> No, it's Kame Ami on. Like, <laughs> don't assume that you've instantly won, but but I have. There's, he's got a little bit of a third tail going on. Who does? Oh yeah. Uh huh. Third, third leg syndrome. Uh, uh, third leg. There you go. Yep. All right. Well, Kimberly's dead. So we have Jessica Kimberly. Who's next? I don't know, dude. Also, is it bad that I kind of just went through a team and didn't realize or didn't pay attention to who the ace was at all? Yeah, no, I'm, I think no. it was the Golduck. Because this is like, it's... 
that, like, passive playing, right? Like, it's like, uh, the problem with driving. Driving is a subconscious oh, yeah, activity. It's so, yeah. And you're just like, wait, how did I get here? <laughs> I just kind of am here. <laughs> you just showed up and I you're exist. like, well, uh, I don't remember driving here at all, but here I am. Yeah, that's the same thing with this. It's, it doesn't matter. You, you just trust your your subconscious to guide you While I'm through just Pokemon. Him, you know, beating Chimekos all this to just, death. All this just determines whether or not you're coming back to play this game again. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> and God, then, I don't want to play this oh, game again. Yeah, whatever. Just just what it happened <laughs> nice <laughs> good job Tribeco. um it made it oh wow <laughs> oh it just it just pulled a really big dumb <laughs> well that's fine with me <laughs> god <laughs> Flake was like here have my water absorber <laughs> oh let me fix that for you here you go <laughs> And what we the hell? Sir. <laughs> uh, that was Why actually... are you leading with a tank, though? Because Brittany be good. It's a tank. Of course it's good. That's why you uh, lead with something like Ernesto. So that we create more of the challenge. No, it doesn't create more of a challenge. You have U-turn on it, and it does damage, and you can switch into the thing that's good to fight with Like it. the Brittany. Like Brittany. I mean, no, Ernesto having U-turns, it's been such good utility, though. Yeah. Also, I'm kind of sad, because, actually, Snorlax I'm not be sad. sniffing his fingers, though. He does. Oh, no. Jump kick? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, this could do some serious damage. No. Oh, no, it could use counter. I oh. was worried for, like, Body slam or something like I that. I think that wouldn't have done anything, it looks like, based off that damage. Well, yeah, but hey, I resisted and non stab. Nope. So. So it still, still have wouldn't done... have killed, but it would have been a crit kill. Crit to kill. That's only because crits are overpowered in the first five gens. Or is it. No, it's five. I think it is or, five. Yeah, I think they changed it. In no, because they changed it because sit in six, because very. Yeah. And then they changed it so the crits do point five, yeah. which is way better. Yes. So much better. Wait, why did you? Ghost type. No, nope, flying. Oh, it's queen. This is gonna do nothing. Why did it hit? Wait, what? <laughs> oh, it's, it's resisted. It's just super quad resisted. Oh, man. That did nothing, though. It really did not. Yeah, it did not do a thing. That's why they switched, I guess. Why didn't they heal their Pokemon then first? Why didn't they just hard switch into this? And yeah, save the potion. <laughs> mm -hmm. Save the potion for the quad weakness. Or the quad resist. Yeah, that's... Because that did nothing. Oof. So... Wrecked. Yeah, that would have been a much better play for that to them to do that instead of waste the And now Vesqueen is going to die. Rip Vesqueen. And now they can't do that. They can't switch again. Nope. <laughs> Wrecked. Dude, the AI kind of makes me sad. <laughs> the AI is just... just bad. <laughs> well... Here's the thing though, like, I I find the the set option and like yeah, you know, set versus switch. Mm -hmm. The the switch option is just little kid mode. Yeah, I think the thing is, is with the switch option, like, it it does. It is a lot easier than the set option. I have thoroughly enjoyed um, Hardcore, which I really want to do another one of those at some point soon, uh, because of the set option and having, because all the important trainers, I don't know if you knew that, but all the important trainers have six months, mm. which makes things super sketch. Yeah, the not being able to heal in battle is 
to totally change it. I think that you, in hardcore, you should be able to, or you should be able to heal, but only be limited to the amount of potions that the opponent has. Um, actually, a lot of creators do that, where it is limited to the amount of heals that the trainer you're facing has, and I like that a lot, and I actually want to experiment with it, because I do agree, I think that does make battles more fair and more even. JUMP CUT TIME! Ah! Okay, so I saw a, a what were those things called? TikToks that said that this tasted like Dr. Pepper. If you did a 50-50 mix of root beer <laughs> and uh, Coca-Cola. So there you go. Try it. That it tastes like Dr. Pepper. Mm-hmm. My god, it does. It had to be specifically the a root beer and we just so happened to have it. So. Weird. There you go. It, like, it's, it's not like an actual Dr. It tastes more like a flat Dr. Pepper, but... Yeah. It tastes like... It still tastes root beery to me. Yeah, no, that's why, that's why I was, that's why I described it as a flat Dr. Pepper. Uh-huh. Because... Technically, you should be able to play the game again. I should be. I'm gonna low kick this thing. Like, I wasn't gonna do it before, but so, <laughs> I'm gonna do the exact same play. Luckily, so actually, Jonas talked about this in 100%. Uh, I've literally said that exact thing. Did you like the. Like the, three times. Oh, in, yeah. It's all vlog in the last three episodes. But we talked about how you getting back into an episode after doing a cut is super weird and super awkward. Oh, yeah. Because I was like, wait, what was I doing again? Even though it was literally like five minutes ago. But. It smells like Dr. Pepper. It, like, the air around it tastes like Dr. Pepper, but the actual thing tastes like root beer. <laughs> I got so lucky. <laughs> no, but it does. Um, like, it does taste like Dr. Pepper. That's weird, man. It is very weird. I, oh, no, I forgot about this part about a blissy. Yeah, this is the best thing. <laughs> He says, oh, I got so lucky. The episode's only going to be 20 years long. <laughs> the episode's only going to have, like, another a very, very long amount of time to, like, be on the pussy. I can edit this, too, by the way. If you want to. I might as well. It's on my computer. I don't have to send it to you. And yeah, because you have my uploaded. Mm -hmm. Upload it, yep. It goes up on Christmas Eve, so you know. Okay. <laughs> I'm like, just see. Whoa. So, Merry Christmas Eve. This wow. is why I'm wearing this, because this is the Christmas present that I got from Joe. Yeah, and I wish other plushies and your peppermint patties. Those are gone already, by the way. Jeez, man. <laughs> I demolished that. <laughs> yeah, the, yeah, that was a big bag of your peppermint patties, too. Yeah, it really was. It was um, a lot of calories of your peppermint patties. Yeah. It was like two pounds. Yeah. <laughs> But to be fair, I didn't eat anything else but York peppermint patties that day, which wow. I don't know if that's much better of a statement. <laughs> did, did, did York peppermint patties come out the same way as they went in? <laughs> yep. <laughs> um, no, but... The minty freshness. <laughs> the minty freshness of York peppermint patties coming to your door. Mm. If we get 2 million subscribers. Yeah, it tastes a little too root beery to be Dr. Pepper. No. Mm -hmm. But if you tone down the root beer, yeah. Yeah. Maybe like if it was like a 40-60 mix? Yeah, I was thinking more of like a 30-70. I could see 30-70 as well, but I know you're not a big root beer person though. Gent Jimmy, yeah. Gent Jimmy. Yeah. No, honestly. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. That big brain answers your question yeah on whether or not so tiktok sometimes like okay tiktok i mean it, it does have it's over exaggerations which is hence what this is yep. it was an over exaggeration of, oh my gosh it tastes like exactly like the hey thing. we can make a viral video by saying that two sodas mixed together taste like a different soda mm -hmm. oh yeah now as it sits too the root beer comes out more yeah 
like you have to drink it immediately like you just chug the thing again it's like the air or like the carbon dioxide bubbles that come off of it taste like dr pepper the, the actual drink tastes like root beer yeah so john mm-hmm. how many ice cubes are supposed to go into a glass a glass this size I don't know. Just my opinion. Just, just your opinion. So, if it's a glass like this, I would say like three. How much four. is that? It's like, what, 16 ounces? I don't know. How much is this, guys? Yeah, it's about 16 ounces. So. Also, I love how we said it's like 16 ounces. Well, I mean, it's not like we just poured two 12 ounce sodas in it. So, yes, it's. It's about 16. It's 16 ounces. Okay. <laughs> and I have three ice cubes. So how many ice cubes go in? Uh, like I said, typically I have three to four. So I like your ice cube ratio here. Do people disagree with your ice cube ratio? I don't know. Do you? Do you yeah. agree how many ice cubes are supposed to go in a glass? Would you prefer crushed ice or whole ice cube? Oh, I'm a whole ice cube kind of person. I prefer a whole ice cubes rather than the the crushed ice and i feel like with the crushed ice you're wasting much more ice too what do you mean wasting ice well i mean like you're i guess you're using a bunch more ice for the same thing you mean drinking the ice cubes rather than just having them sit and be wasted in the glass afterward i don't know what you mean <laughs> well, no because i i still drink the ice cubes out of the glass ew uh, ooh. Ooh, what, what is this kind of guy, dude? <laughs> if it doesn't melt in there, don't go in your mouth. Great. That's that's my philosophy when it comes to that. Like, I will crunch them, maybe. Like, right now, I would probably drink it, crunch it. But if it, like, if it was, I drank everything, and then there was this ice cube sitting in there, and it melted, melted ice cube water, I wouldn't drink that. Ew. Yeah, I'd still drink it. Unless it's with soda like uh, this. I couldn't do that with this. But, oh, I was stupid. I forgot that I only have Seed Bomb as my super effective attack. For some reason, I thought I had Energy Ball. <laughs> so, crap. It actually is better to surf the thing. That's so weird for me to say out loud. It's better actually no air slash is better air slash is the best possible move here and here's why so for all you guys at home why that are asking me why am i not clicking the super effective move well cloister has 180 base stat total in defense versus it's 30 base stat total in special defense saying total doesn't actually work but still work because it's not total it's, it's just, total it's defense base stat yeah. It's base total is the total of, of all. all of them. <laughs> wow, that did nothing. It did a lot more than energy or than your uh, seed bomb. bomb. So do your seed bomb and prove you're right. Bubble beam, bruh. Bruh. Quad resisted. <laughs> that did more than I thought. Yeah, that did. All right, here you go. This is proof. This is evidence, you guys. Are you kidding? Are we... No, I did about the same. How? <laughs> How did it do about the same, though? I thought it would do about the same. <laughs> That's why I said do it. <laughs> why? You got me curious. Hold on. It's 80 base power and uh, 75 base power. And then also your attacks. Lower than my special attack. Yep. Yep. Ta da! <laughs> <laughs> but th what about Cloyster's stats, though? Yeah, so Cloyster has lower special defense and higher defense, but you have stabbed to make up for that. That's what I didn't account for. Yep. Oh my gosh. Why? Here comes the cricket tune. <laughs> if I would have air slashed, that would have been a pro play. 
<laughs> yeah, you're in faster anyways, it didn't matter. You're faster than this, though. Yes, I should be. But are you staying in against a potential uh, Megahorn? I don't know. What comes from a Cricketoon? What's threatening from a Cricketoon? <laughs> um... Nothing much, but I want the chat to be able to kill more Pokemon and have more of a decision, so... You don't want to kill off your own Pokemon on purpose? No. Not for the sake of experimentation? No. <laughs> Um, Although, I was gonna say, that, <laughs> that did a good chunk of damage too. Yeah, uh, Cricketune has a 5% chance of holding a metronome when you catch it. That would make sense, actually. I didn't know that for some reason, but yeah. Isn't there, there's Pokemon that like can hold lucky eggs, isn't there? Um, if it is, it's probably just chancy. Or it might be the not an odd egg, um, the the egg that they hold. That's like the fake egg that Happy holds. What is that? Happy holds a fake egg. Yeah, it, it like literally holds a fake egg to pretend like it's an egg. Happy is weird. Happy like I'm gonna be the best Pokemon by taking care and nurturing other people with my rock hard egg. <laughs> I don't think Happiny thinks anything. Hey, you wanna go for a walk after this? I would love to do that. Nice. I got myself kind of set up to do that. I am much. hyped up off of sugar right now because I've drank like two of these things. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you have. <laughs> <laughs> no, we haven't gone on an actual walk outside in a while. Yeah, and there's Christmas lights outside. Mm -hmm. I, yeah, you did a lot of that with Christmas lights set up. Yeah, well, I have to put up more Christmas lights. You guys see my background here? There's Christmas lights that are behind this now instead of being what they were, which was LED strips. I decided that I wanted to put Christmas lights. They're also around, uh, well, John has to move his head. I don't have to move my head. There you go. Look, they're around that, too. I haven't sealed them in place yet. Oh, so there's these little sticky, um, like, dots for the uh, LED strips to hold them in place and uh, like so they're basically like a little clip that looks like this and then they, they have like a little part that plastic part that goes like that and seals it down and then you just slide the wire in between them that holds it and uh, and they I never knew that I had kept them I had like a big bag of them and I had kept them and I kept them <laughs> In a uh, in a box that happened to have uh, some really old five gum spearmint oh, that. flavor in the box too, and it made everything in the whole box smell like that. And it was like, what the heck? Yeah. But I'm happy that I found them because now I can I can actually use them. Oh, it was also more failures for me because my lack of lack of research into figuring out what I actually need for specific things. I bought a thing like five years ago or something that I didn't know what it was. Or I thought it was the right thing, but it wasn't the right thing. And uh, and that was in that box too. It was like, it's like my box of like failures that I have. <laughs> the, the box, box of, of random the, things. The box of bought failures <laughs> that I just like, had when I was younger like I have a a cable that's that I was supposed to be for the microphone but it wasn't actually an end to the microphone it was like it was like an instrument end to it so it wouldn't actually plug into the the audio interface <laughs> and I was like oh well I'll we'll just hide this in my box of shame now <laughs> because I was dumb and didn't just return stuff or like you know do anything with it. <laughs> just like kept in a box of shame. <laughs> so Have that you... was in there too. <laughs> oh no! Higher Another level one luck. of these. <laughs> Man, it's got roots. Have you ever had a like song that just makes you cry for no reason? Um, for no reason, no. This one, this the the be not this part of it, but the beginning when Cynthia like the the like piano. Mm. Oh my god, it gets me every time. And I don't know why. Because it's just like, it's just a piano, but 
like, okay. It's just the, the sound of sadness. It, it really is. It, like, they did a really good job with this theme because literally in my head, I'm just like, okay, we're here. We're at the final battle. And, and it's I'm the nervous. highest level of champion. I can't... I don't know how to deal with this Pokemon, actually. Evidenced by the fact that <laughs> did a lot. Um, yeah, I really don't know what to do about Togekiss. Togekiss is um, annoying, yeah. And because it has a roost, it makes it even worse because mm. it just self heals itself. Oh, wow. Oh, look at this. Self heals right. itself. As it's gonna oh, self herm itself. Nice. That's pretty close to half, but it's not half. So you can, like, live another one. I could. Do you really need it? I don't- I wouldn't even try to heal Lucario. I'd just be like, you- if you die, I don't care. It's at the end of the game. Well, I don't- but, I, see, I don't but, want to carry over right. this stupid Lucario. <laughs> I don't want to have the possibility of keeping it, so I would just end it now. <laughs> just end it before it actually mm -hmm. has a chance. I mean, hey, you know... <laughs> if that was a crit... <laughs> it actually would have died, too. It min-max rolled. Uh, there was only a 4 HP difference between the hits, John. Oh, it just went into the yellow. Yeah, it just went into the yellow. <laughs> <laughs> also, she roosts, right? No, why is she brain burning? Because she wants you to die and stay in with Lucario and risk the... The crit-olies crit. that's about that to... Yup, there it is! <laughs> oh, that was a mineral crit, no! <laughs> Uh, no, it wouldn't have killed Lucario anyways. We already determined this. <sighs> Bruh. Wait, I, now I can just use Extreme Speed for what it's supposed to be. You really suck at this game, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> God. <laughs> Let me just hit the same mistake twice. Yeah. Well, see, but I don't know if I'm faster than this thing anymore. Oh, no. we credit back, so that actually helps. Nice. Now you can... Now we can heal, and then... Heal up our stupid ferret. Yep. Guys, please kill ferret. <laughs> Joy will do it, because you get to kill that. They get to kill... Not only do they get to kill three mons, if I survive with all of them, they get to kill four, because this is episode 120. So what happens if you, um, lose two of your mons? Then they just, then you just lose the game and you have to play it over again? No, because it, they kill half the team. So they kill half the team and then kill one more. But what if you only had two mons left? Then I die. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I'm on, Cynthia! <laughs> you got the, There's nothing that can kill all of the Pokemon on your team. No. Maybe. Maybe a. Uh. uh Zapdos? Tauros that has Gideon. anger point. <laughs> and you accidentally crit it, and then it just bodies you with So something. speaking of mods that actually kind of- oh wait, no, we have Brittany. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> It'll be fine, we have Brittany. We, we learned Honchkrow actually has Aeroblast too, so Honchkrow's annoying. But we have Brittany who has got like 220 special <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You could have been a Letty in in another universe you were a Letty in Brittany. In Letty in is Letty in has 110 special defense. So somebody on that when I made a post about how Letty in has a really, 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 really high <laughs> special defense, someone yeah. was like, it must be the very normal 110 special defense. And I looked it up and it's like top 5 percent, the top 95 percentile of Pokemon. So it's better than 95 percent of Pokemon. I don't have leftovers on Brittany for the rest of this battle. And, uh, and it made me annoyed because it was like, bruh, it triggered. I mean, you can't say it's normal. It's definitely not normal. No. It beats out most legendaries. 30% of its investment is in special defense. <laughs> it's got, actually, I know this because um, I was looking up... Oh, I was bored at work. I Dang it, I didn't look at the Pokemon that was coming up. I mean, I'll just go like set mode here. Not the old entire way, but... Please be the ace. Dang it, it's not. 
Uh, because I was at work, I was bored, so I was tracking each individual Pokemon's uh, base stat total mm -hmm. uh, for a fully evolved Pokemon in the game. Because I was going to talk about it in Soul Link, where my team was rough. We had a point in time where my team was really rough, and now it's a much better. We are much more balanced. So, from work... <clears throat> we put up Christmas lights during this time of the year. Obviously, it's Christmas time. We yep. put up Christmas. Tomorrow's Christmas. Yeah. Christmas lights in uh, December and starting in November, we do Christmas lights. And uh, because we do custom Christmas lights, where we get strand that has sockets and then you have eh, eh, about 50 million bags of bulbs that look like this yeah and they have bulbs and you got the line and you have to screw the damn bulb into the line look how easy this is boom did one right that's actually that was really quick it's so fast and easy until you have to do freaking 500 of them per house. Yeah. So I have, I had a, I, by the end of the season, I have like calluses built up on my index and thumb from just both hands from screwing. just screwing bulbs in. And so I was using this screw <laughs> to sand down my calluses <laughs> on my finger while we're doing this. <laughs> yeah. So that's what that's for? <laughs> this is why I've had this in my pocket. Oh, I was using that to, like, clear... Yeah, I, I had this in my pocket for work for a while. Because it was uh, helpful for taking down the stupid callus. It's annoying. Because it gets built up and then it's like, you can't feel anything with it. You need to be able to feel your T23 and finger. Sharpedo. It, it feels weird because your fingers get numb after a while from doing that. Too. This could be the ace. <sighs> they would not. Going to babe. Bad. Going to babe. Do it. Murder babe. No balls. Murder babe. You have babe. to get down to two Pokemon by the end of this. I mean, if this isn't the ace, then we might still have a chance of it. We might still have a chance of it. Because <laughs> this ain't the Arceus. ace. Arceus. Anger point Arceus. Belly drum, is, Arceus. Is Anger Point part of the... I don't think Anger Point's in this generation. Anger Point... Anger... I'm pretty sure it is. I thought it was Generation 5. I don't know. Is it... Well, what Pokemon would have it? I thought it was Tauros that actually did have it. I don't have my phone. So Tauros has it, yeah. I don't know. Either way. Anger Point Pokemon. Something like that. What is it? <gasps> what is it? According to Bulbapedia, Bulba Garden, it's a hypno. It's they know about. Wait! Oh my gosh! It how goes out today. The, 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 how fitting! <laughs> hypno is Cynthia's level seventy-six Pokemon on the day that how does no <laughs> spend Christmas Eve? <laughs> Teaser goes out. <laughs> If you didn't know what John just said, because he was laughing his whole way through that. Oh my god. We have a, I made a post on my channel that, that talks about Nose from Yurlock, who is kind of a Pokemon that haunts us for the rest of the game. Yeah. Well, for the rest of the entire series. So, um. And it's going to haunt the dreams of a couple of these Pokemon, because Hypno is a Pokemon that could get really scary. You have a bug type Pokemon that can just like two or three shot this. Probably two shot it, because it actually doesn't have very good defenses. But yeah, look at his nose. It's so big. But yeah, so that's hilarious. That's what the nose is here. I'm gonna just bug buzz it. I think you two shot it. Oh, I definitely two-shot it. Yep. Wow! N what the heck, Nose? 
It doesn't have very good special defense. It doesn't have really good stats in general. It's kind of just... And it just took my ability and... Oh no, it wants to run away. <laughs> oh, poor guy. He just wants to survive. <laughs> he just wants to live, man. He just wants to live. Oh, let him live. Oh, sad. He can't run away, though. It's a trainer battle. Well, he's not dying to her nest. It's a crit. Wow. No, it wasn't. It was just... It just killed it. <laughs> it was, so wait, what was Ernesto's attack stat? Because that's like 2 or 20 base power lower. <laughs> there it is. Uh, what? How did it kill without a crit? What? I don't understand. It. Oh my gosh, Ernesto. That doesn't make any sense to me. How did that do that much damage? 20 base power lower and 30 attack lower. <laughs> so it was like 40 almost. Wow. Alright, that was a lot of money. It should give you $15,000. $15, Who has the aim? There you go. Point? You're on the Gen 5. Yeah. How does it feel? Um, I need my revenge from the Wonder Guards, Kyogres. <laughs> oh, yeah. What about if you get a Wonder Guard Groudon? If I run into one or get one? You just run into one and you lose to it. Oh god. Then I have to come back here again. Would you just do it in one episode? You're like, alright guys, one episode, we're gonna get this whole damn <laughs> game. Sleepwalk the game in episodes. Just, we're doing it. Okay. No, not even in episodes, just one episode that you just have edited down to like 20 minutes, like a normal episode of you just beating <laughs> the whole game in one sitting. Just, this is how I beat that, this... This is how I beat Gen 4 for the third time in Saga 1. <laughs> yep. Well. Uh, yes. Yeah. Um, so, again, for all of you guys, I know we're talking about your luck like a bunch, but we can talk about it now, so I'm literally going to talk about it way too many times. And um, if you guys don't know about the Yearlock teasers, there is a link to the channel or to the channel where all of Yearlock is being posted, um, and it's gonna link you straight to the teaser where I got this hat. So, and then you should subscribe to that channel if you haven't already, because <laughs> there's gonna be a lot of content over there. <laughs> we already have a lot of content ready over there, which is awesome. So, and we'll see you guys uh, as we further lament our journey into the what region? You know the region. <laughs> but I was gonna say Kalos because I want to be in Kalos and I'm already making a mess in the room. And y'all get to kill four Pokemon. <laughs> so choose four Pokemon you want to murder. Uh, let's see, Lucario is gonna die. Your, your babe's gonna die. Brittany's gonna live. Dakon's gonna live. So everybody Nesto but Brittany. And, and Tito. Yep. So you want everybody gone except for Brittany and Dakon. Yep. Okay, I'll keep that. I'll just like literally just mentally write that down for you. Okay, we'll keep you keep time. game squattering. Squatting. Game Thank game. You. I wish it had something like Keep. Me. Keep gaming. Yeah, keep on gaming. Uh, dude, you are really bad at this. <laughs>